Today I'm going to show how to find the percentage increase in a directly proportional data. And let's see the exercise. Here I have x is proportional to the square root of y and the y is positive. The y is increased by 44%. Find the percentage increase in the x. So we want to find the percentage change when the y it changes by 44%. The first thing to do is a directly proportional data. This is a directly proportional data. So the equation that describes a direct proportion is this one. Y equals K times the X. In this case, the X is proportional to the square root of Y. So I write the equation as X is equal to K times square root of Y. And now the y it changes by 44%. It increases. And if it's a percentage increase, we go to the multiplier. Find the multiplier. What is the multiplier? This is a change of x. In this case, is if it changes by x percent, then the multiplier is 1 plus the percentage. Now, let's go and see this exercise. The x is equal to the k times the square root of y. Because the, we don't have numbers, but we have all the per percentage changes, we can make the, y, the original value of y to be 1. We can make the original value of the y to be 1. And the value of the y after the 44% increase, it will be 1.44. I found the 1.44 as the multiplier is 1 plus the percentage, 0 0.44. This gives you 1.44. I put these numbers into the equation above and I need to find the change in x. This is what the question is asking. So my equation after the percentage increase, it will look like this one x is equal to the k times the square root of 1.44y. The original equation was k times the square root of 1y. After the change, the equation is x is equal to the k times the square root of 1.44y. Now, what is the square root of 1.44? Is The calculator is 1.2. Okay, is 1.2. So this equation is simplified as 1.2k root y. And the change on the x, if you compare now these two equations, the original one and the new one, the change is the 1.2 only. The other variables are exactly the same. So what we have here, we have 1k, here I have 1.2. 1.2 change. Now, if it's 1.2 change, means the multiplier is 1 plus the 0 0.2, which give you 1.2. Now, the percentage change on the x is the 0 0.2, 20% change. And now, this answers this exercise. This is a question on direct proportion, but is not exactly in direct proportion. It's linked with percentage increases. So the percentage change on X when the Y changes by 44% increase is 20% as the final answer.